hi guys hi guys like i normally tell you i am always trying to bring you um content uh, take you to some of the places that you have not been or even you've been but no details and today i'm in uh omabe county and i'm exploring some of the areas um in this particular area and this place is so beautiful as you can be able to see and what you see there is uh lake victoria all the way and um i have a friend of mine and he has a channel called uh, isaac on the bike and you can kindly go and check his video and so he comes from this area and so just wanted him just to explain to us a little bit about this area and some few things so isaac here you are yes today i'm i'm around <laughs> Thank you. So we are really surrounded by water. Totally, 100% surrounded by water. Okay. Only connected to the mainland by, by a very uh, small bridge. Okay. That was built just recently. Okay. Yeah. So actually, this is the I think this is the highest accessible point. Yeah. To Singa Island, and uh, it's Litare. There's a beach here called Litare Beach, mm -hmm. and. Uh, the economic activity of this place is simply fishing. Daytime fishing, there's night fishing. Actually, as I was walking around, I could smell fish yes, all through. Yes, that is Omena, all the yeah. fingerlings being dried. Okay. So, at night, you guys go for fishing, and the lake is dotted with lights. You may think it's a city. Okay. But, uh, yeah, this is Rusinga. Rusinga is a beautiful place, by the way. Yeah. It has got beautiful beaches, mm -hmm. nice hotels, mm -hmm. you know, like uh, Whitestone Hotel. Mm -hmm. So many other hotels. There's Rusinga Lodge. Mm -hmm. There's so many of them. Okay. Uh, a beautiful place. Mm -hmm. and several beaches also. All the way from Mid and Sayang to Sienga Beach, uh, Litari Beach, going back to uh, uh, all the way to uh, Kamayogi and all that. So there's so many of them. Okay. So yeah, that is Rusinga Hospital, but it's also <laughs> a place. It's the home of uh, the legendary. Tom Boya, you okay. know, the trade unionist. Yeah. Yeah, the late Tom Boya. His home is just somewhere across here. Okay. Around, uh, call it around three, four hundred meters okay. from where we are. Okay. The way he was buried and everything. Okay. So, on this side is, uh, this is Uganda. Oh. The expanse, you can't see any landmass. Okay. But that is Uganda. And then that over there is the island. It's Mfangano Island. It's bigger than Rusinga, actually. Mm. It's uh, the biggest island in um, the Lake Victoria side of Kenya. Yeah. Uh, also, there are boats that go there regularly. There are water buses. There are ferries. So there are vessels that transport people to that place. Nice island. Someday you need to visit also. Yes, I did. Uh, I will make a visit when uh, we are not busy. Yes, yes. So much, yeah. You need to come. Kuja mm. Gari, Panda Ferry, go. Spend <laughs> your time there. Yeah. yeah. So, that, the expanse there, the wide sea, uh, lake is all the way to Uganda. Okay. All the way to Uganda. Mm -hmm. That's why you, and it, it's a fishing ground. It's a rich fishing ground. Mm -hmm. It has got a lot of fish. Mm -hmm. That's why sometimes you hear of uh, fishing conflict with Uganda. Those are the areas where people oh, go and fish. Okay. Uh, stories have it that some people go and you know that these fishing sprees where you spend two, three days, mm -hmm. some cast their nets in the water, they are fatigued, and then the, the boat is drifted by the wind. Mm -hmm. uh, when they wake up like three, four hours up, uh, uh, down the line, they find themselves in Uganda. <laughs> and then uh, they're being woken up by policemen. Ugandan policemen and told, hey, you trespass, but it's the wind that carries them. Mm. But this is where all that drama happens. <laughs> it is the wind that carries them. Yeah, they never, in, uh, they never <laughs> rode there. So they lost their nets and they lost direction. They're now in cases with the Ugandan police. Government, yeah. So, yeah, but those are tales of the lake. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this expanse has got many stories. Some people go and they, they lose directions mm -hmm. and some disappear forever. Ah. Yeah, some just disappear forever. Mm -hmm. Some people, there are also people who know how to read the the stars. Okay. So when when you're lost essentially in the lake, you'll have to wait until it is night. Mm -hmm. That's when you can find your way. Oh. Funnily enough. Mm. Because during the day and you're deep in the lake, all you can see is mist around you and no landmass. So you don't know. Mm -hmm. You don't know where the sun is. 
-hmm. You don't know whether it's almost setting or not, so you can't tell the direction. Mm -hmm. So what they do, they wait until it is dark mm -hmm. and then they read the stars. Okay. They know this star is the is usually from this northern, mm -hmm. you know, you know, Orion the Hunter, the northern star, all those uh, <laughs> <laughs> constellations that mm. we used to learn they yeah. use them to find the direction then they row mm -hmm. back to kenya okay so yeah there's so many stories about the lake mm -hmm. uh, over here okay that's yes. good so i'm so happy to visit this place and i believe that uh, there is a lot that you can do with this water i believe like uh, farming near the shores yes because this is fresh water it is it is and so we can be able to do a lot clean fresh water it's not only fresh but clean mm -hmm. all along okay fresh water mm -hmm. you can use it for farming mm -hmm. agribusiness or horticulture okay. very good mm -hmm. very good so guys if you have not visited this area kindly do visit it's a very beautiful place and those who are not from kenya this is Kenya and actually Kenya is very beautiful, Kenya in Africa and so just look at the way this place looks like. Um, this is part of Lake Victoria and like the way Isaac has explained, there is a lot that you can be able to learn from these areas and uh, there is a lot of fish around and there is a school there for the community and here they are doing a project for water for the community so this is something good for the people around here so uh we are so grateful and uh they are fresh fish like this one you can see here this is fresh eh? so how much is this one this one mm -hmm. so it's, uh, about 400. 400, eh? okay. okay okay and it's very fresh it's clap yeah? yeah okay okay let me okay let me do